Before we can take measurements, we need to bleed the air out of the lines and zero the gauge pressure sensor. First thing we need to do is turn the instrument on and zero the gauge pressure sensor. It'll go through a startup routine. The instrument will ask us if we want to zero the gauge pressure sensor. We press the enter key. There'll be instructions on the display on how to do that. Basically keep both the pressure ports open in the atmosphere and press the enter key. When it completes the gauge zeroing process for the gauge pressure sensor, it'll go into its run mode and it'll show the differential pressure, high side and low side pressure simultaneously. To zero the differential pressure sensor, we turn the valve handle from measure to bypass. At this point, when you zero the differential pressure sensor, the unit can be under pressure. It does not have to be open to atmosphere. When it's done zeroing the differential pressure sensor, we can turn the valve handle back to measure and we can start connecting our hoses. The red hose to the positive port, blue hose to the negative port. To bleed the air out, we'll connect the red hose to the positive side of the valve. We'll turn the ports on, the valves on. And start the system. Once you have a steady stream of fluid, you can then turn the valves on the hoses to the close position and turn the knob on the meter back to measure.